Yeah. Like that call, yeah. Assisting on the tip, and he gets it. 19-11. Still an eight-point lead here for UST in this third set. Whoa. <laughs> now we see the re-entry of Garbin to replace mm. Martinez. It seems that Martinez really hasn't found her, hasn't found her rhythm and it's very important as the setter of the team to get your own rhythm before you start setting off those uh, plays for your teammates. And is a facet of De La Salle's game that we haven't seen. Uh, wow. They're down by 10 points in a set. Actually, no surprises. Fifth best server in the league, Didi Santiago. Alpha. Even the best. State of errors coming from De La Salle. They're going to get the Lady Spikers. I think they can write this third set off yeah. pretty much and just regroup yeah. and try to make up for the mistakes in the fourth set. The Jaguar continues to serve. Another block also. Next set. Alarka. That's still good. Mercado going up. Nice coverage by Mercado. She goes up for the hit. Matika is there. Back set. That's right. You know what? It's like USD just moved on to a higher gear. Parang may extra pang gear na pinasokan tong USD. And they just are blowing this thing open. Shifted to another level. Almost getting away from Chuck Cruz there. But uh, this is a lot of points that Lasalle needs to make up. And a substitution here. Cerveza coming in now to serve. Oh, she came in actually earlier. Mm -hmm. Quick. Ortiz was red. Mercado off the block. That's the way to do it. That's the way to do it. You saw the angle of her shoulders on, this, on that attempt. Talagang, she had that thing, you know. Gusto niya talagang patamain lang sa block to swipe it away the hands of the blockers. We can expect for Kaji to get the, uh, the bulk of the sets here yeah. because now she is the reliable one. Oh, just getting it off the block. She already knows how to do it. So, right. you know, if it ain't broke, <laughs> that's, the, that's the play that works. So just go, keep going for it. And, Sham na lang. <laughs> and let's see if Aiza Maiso has learned her lesson. <laughs> Two points na yun na uh, pinapalusot sa kanya. Let's see. If Lasal can hold USD at 23. One more time. Again to Mercado. <laughs> wow. Expect the unexpected from Steph Mercado. And USD also defeated the call of timeout of the three straight points. I'm going to go to the next one. 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 Sa maganari si, pag sila atake, ganun pa rin. Black, depensa tayo. Pato ng depensa. Okay, nag-i-relax agad. Ah, may ka. Sabat ni God, ito. Maybe let's just write this one off yet. That's a Michelle got to win. Oh, yeah. Former player. Yeah, last year. Oo. Marami na siyang mga ano. Yung mga kapalit niya pinapanood. Oo, oo. Michelle Tatuin, we know, a very excellent middle attacker, yes. middle blocker for De La Salle. Oh! Two players from La Salle, Michelle Tatuin, from Manila Santos, pero nandito na yung kanilang mga ano, replacements. And La Salle's just, uh, they just keep trucking, holding USD at 23. Okay, for a team like La Salle, this is not impossible. Coach Jack, it's too early to celebrate. Oh. Nice, uh, red there by Cerveza. Set point, let's see if LaSalle can hold them and keep on scoring. It's going to be a tough climb for LaSalle if they're able to do that. Si Tamakero pa naman ang nasa number one server 
in the league. <laughs> Set with that one and maybe stretch it to a fifth one. All that coming up after the break.